Good morning. It's Wednesday. Wednesday. It's half past eight. I was gonna try and get up a little bit earlier. I'm mean, like I was awake, but I just decided to stay in bed for a little bit because you know. I was a bit poorly yesterday morning. I went and took my meds at the same time. Mm. I've taken two extra on an empty stomach and that was not a good idea and um, I felt a bit poorly sick and like not very with it so I lay down on the sofa for the morning um, didn't do my parcels no poster or anything so I've got double the amount to do today so I've got 23 and an Etsy list um, order to do hmm. um, yeah, because I woke up with like a splitting headache. So silly of me to take them at the same time on an empty stomach, but I did. And, you know. So yeah, all of that post today. And, um, and then we're going to go to Puff Call. I don't know if the table sale's still on on a Wednesday, but we shall find out. And we'll see if there's anything there worth buying. Meanwhile, I've just had a question from a customer about um, a listing that ended. They're saying that there's something wrong with the delivery. Well, considering it was only picked up yesterday, like, we shall see. Anyways, I'm going to go figure that out. And I'm also going to have my ketogenic bread with some with country like stuff, butter and then the other one with um, whole earth peanut butter. Okay, so shall we do sales going out? Go on then, why not? Seeing as we're here, you can skip a bit if you uh, want to skip this, obviously. So we've got the Nunicorn. This is by JJ, Jeanette Jewelry. Um, pendant necklace, £12.50. Seven of these little pins going out. It's mad. I'm selling them at one ninety nine each. Three people have bought um, two, and there's a discount like if you buy more than one. So there we go, that's cool, some of them going out. I saw a lot of empty jewellery boxes, 9 99 A blue and green glass long necklace, 9 99 A pair of Figaro chain necklaces, £10. Some job lot of costume jewellery rings, £12. A grey shirt, vintage grey shirt, £5.50, uh, Greek key ring, £7.99, uh, long shirt, flowery thing, £7, um, ooh, lovely sale, gorgeous coral necklace with 9 karat gold clasp, £74.99 and another nice sale, a stamped 333 brooch, 333 is eight carat gold. It's eight carat white gold and diamond brooch, 45 pounds. A plastic color length necklace, 13 pounds 59. A little sparkly flower brooch, five pounds. A sterling silver and mother of pearl heart pendant necklace, 11 99. A Swarovski Stardust um, bangle choke thing 1899 a sparkly tennis bracelet from tjc 10 pounds a laverne embroidered pennant flag nine pounds 59 an art deco style ball collar length necklace 15.99 and a little job lot of crucifixes and religious bits 14.99 oh and over on etsy this lovely little etched octagonal bangle and a bunch of stuff waiting for payment as well so um that was reasonably quick and painless now i've got to package it all up waiting at the bus stop yeah we are bus is going to come from back there and then we're going to go to Puff Call. Yay. Um, I think it's coming up to about 20 past 10, something like that. So yeah, hopefully the table sale is on, that I don't miss too much of it. 
and then we'll have a little bit of a mooch. So, in the meantime, let's have some sped up footage and a bit of music, shall we? Go on then. So here we are, in Puss Call, um, table sale is on, so let's go have a mooch. What are we going to find today? Pictures? <laughs> <laughs> lots of jigsaws, lots of media. <laughs> Free to a good home, donation appreciated. See anything in there? Bizarre. Jug with a chip. I think so. Got a little bit of jewellery there, not much. Um, I think it's about a tenner in there. But obviously, I'll show you what I bought at some other point. But now we're going to go to Puthcall Animal Welfare Society and the rest of the charity shops. Yay!
gotta go now. We're back in Bajen finally. I say finally, it's but moment for you, but it's been over an hour for me because I had to wait for, um, well, there was canceled buses because there's no drivers, there's a driver shortage. Apparently they will be coming truck drivers and stuff now. Anyways, I'm in Bridgend, so we're gonna run around the charity shops quickly, then I've gotta do a couple of errands. Nothing super exciting. I've gotta go to the jewelers and pay for um, a bit of restringing that's being done. Um, yeah. Okay, charity shop. Aaron's done in Bridge End, and I also popped into um, another charity shop and I bought something for £20 that is a bit of a gamble, but we'll see. Um, walking home now because it's a nice day and because, you know, let's get some steps in. Passing the King's Head, which is a nice pub that um, my nephew, when he moves back from Leeds, is going to start working in so that's all right and it's just round the corner from where my gran and grandma's uh, ashes are laid so that's nice it means you can visit them <laughs> i really want to get a haircut like the back of my hair doing um but i wonder if it's a bit late in the day to do that I might do that later on in the week We'll have a think. Well, I just tried a couple of uh, hairdressers on the way home. Um, one of them was bleaching someone's hair and it looked um, like it was going a bit wrong. And um, another one I just kind of peeped in through the, through the window and um, you shouldn't judge people by their appearances, obviously, but her eyebrows looked very brutal. And I thought, I don't want, I don't want to be chopped by that person because they may go a little bit too far so no haircut for me today which you know was asking a lot anyway to just walk in and go do me hey ho right let's uh let's find our way home Woo! 
so I was going like that. There we go. And I appear to be a news pub. How did that happen? Yeah. <laughs> and um, quick haul. I'll prop you against my cup of Costa. There we go. Because Mia was just asking what, what I bought. And I said, I bought loads of Japanese stuff. Nice. Nice jewelry box. Oh, and then the other half of your page, isn't that lovely? That's so sweet. And then a bit of material. Like a, Ooh. I know. It's kind of groovy, isn't it? That really is. And then like 12 little plates for 20 pounds on miniature plates. But <laughs> they're really pretty. So they're like oh. little Japanese painted plates. They're so cool. And they're all different. They're um, 1982, the Hanminatu fruit, I don't know. Oh my days! But yeah, I've got 12 of them. I reckon some of them are going to be collectible little things. Well, I mean, they're obviously collectible because someone collected them in the first place and then, <laughs> you know. But God knows what they spent on them. In the 80s This as well. is... They're not all the same brand, but they're all like Japanese similar like what would they have on them though spices and stuff i know you put like your sushi and stuff on them and then you put like your wasabi in there and dip dip nice. dip but i just thought that they were really nice. lovely aren't they that is nice i like that one that one's that cute. Is cute oh yeah so i've got 12 of them because <laughs> oh this is a really pretty one oh. This is a fun part of wrapping them all, though. <laughs> <laughs> and then wrapping them back up. Yeah. And that's lovely, oh. isn't it? Yeah, that's my favourite. That's See, as well. That's really nice, isn't it? So, yeah. And then a whole load of jewellery and other bits. So, yeah, before I get a copyright strike for having music in the background. <laughs> well, I am back home. Didn't get the haircut, as you can see. Never mind. Um, jewellery haul obviously will be for another video but other little things I bought I'm not sure if I showed you that but I spent £4 on um, Clinique Happy 50 mils um, not sure if I'll keep it or sell it we'll see can't remember how much this was I think maybe a pound but it's just like a weird leafy thing yeah um and someone can tell me what music this is. That would be great, thank you. I'm gonna make myself some dinner. I've taken out one of the ready meals. Um, so I'm gonna have chicken and leek crumble so this is from the low carb food company link below if you um fancy any of these things um this looks to be reasonably higher in calories oh this could be about 900 calories really yeah i, I might hang on uh, 750 this is going to be about 800 odd calories just in that so we better be worth it um it's because it's got double cream and cheese and full fat cheese and butter and almonds and stuff in it um but considering i haven't had lunch today i'm sure it'd be all right and i'm gonna have it with some veg on the side yeah so i'm gonna get that started because i am quite hungry now and um, tidy away all of the stuff that I have bought today and choose what things I'm going to put in Sparkly Things video. Um, that I do have a face Facebook group now. It's Bad Biscuit Sparkly um, Bits. Link is below here if you want to join. Mm -hmm. Well, here it is all done. So that's like the um, chicken and leek crumble type thing. It smells really good with some cauliflower rice and green beans. Yum, yum. Oh my God, that was the last dinner. Seriously, I think that's been 
my favorite of the uh, local food company ready meals so far so that one the beef bourguignon and the madras are my favorites oh that was delicious right that's gonna have to be me for the evening because i've got to get this all together uh there will be a sparkly things video happening soon um and then also tomorrow i think i've got a delivery of jewelry maybe as if there's not enough jewelry but hey ho till tomorrow then bye bye now bye bye